How to crochet the waddle stitch. For this stitch, you will need a crochet hook. Special thanks to our sponsor Scassell for providing today's hooks. Today we are using their Addy Swing Ergonomic Crochet Hooks in the size US 8H. And a ball of yarn. For this stitch, you'll need to know the following techniques. Chain stitch, single crochet, double crochet. To begin this stitch, you must create a foundation chain in multiples of three. Row one. We're going to begin by skipping two chain stitches and we're going to work a single crochet into the next stitch. And this will start our repeat. Okay, then we're going to chain one and we are going to do a double crochet into the same stitch. And we're going to finish our repeat by skipping two more chains. And then we'll start our repeat again by doing a single crochet into the next stitch. So we'll continue repeating this sequence until we reach the last stitch in our row. And when we reach the last repeat, we're going to skip two stitches and then we will do a single crochet into the last stitch in our row. That will turn our work. Row two, we're going to begin by chaining one. Then we're going to skip the next two stitches and we're going to do a single crochet into the next chain one space. Then we're going to chain one and do a double crochet into that same space. So we're going to repeat this sequence until we reach the end of the row. We'll be working into the next chain one space. And when we finish our last repeat, we're going to do a single crochet into the top chain from our turn chain in the row before. Okay, and then we'll turn our work. So we're going, to, we're going to repeat row two until we reach our desired length. And that's how you crochet the waddle stitch. After a few repeats, your pattern should look like this. Want more New Stitch Today? Check out our website at newstitchaday.com.